Hi, I'm Mike. And I'm Terry. We are full-time treasure hunters and resellers. We work hard. And we play hard. We travel the Northwest buying storage units as well as scouring the United States for liquidation merchandise. Our 20 years of experience has created a passion for reselling and has allowed us to spend time with our family and enjoy recreational and travel around the world. We believe laughter is the medicine of life and we are here to share it with you. Please join us on this journey and keep laughing with Mike and Terry's Retail. Hey guys, Mike and Terry here, back with you again today for another big, beautiful blue palette unwrapping. Correct. Yeah. So, th hey, thanks for tuning in again today, guys. We appreciate it. All your amazing comments. I know. We did something, I don't know when this video is coming out, but we did something really funny in yesterday's video. The egg. And <laughs> I didn't want to reveal it. Some people might not have seen it yet. Well, now they know. They got to go watch it. They might it. be a couple weeks behind. They're going to have to be like, oh gosh, I got to watch. I got to binge watch. I got to find what this egg is. <laughs> binge watch, Mike and Terry. <laughs> And the MT Coffee Crew, welcome. Uh, yes, welcome everybody, and uh, welcome to our channel. If you're not new, or if you're not new, or if you're not something, <laughs> it's a struggle today, guys. <laughs> we stayed if you're up. Not subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. <laughs> Forty-three point nine percent of you guys still are not subscribed. I have no clue what you're waiting for. Join in. Join in. I don't what know. were you starting to say? We stayed up late. We stayed up way too late last night, you guys. We had two grandkids spend the night last night. One of them had a birthday, and we were just having a great time. It was and, just the four of us, two grandkids and us, and um, we and played. it was just late, got up yeah. early, and here we are. It was a good time. We played Monopoly. We played I Go Seek Through the House. We found out that there's dust bunnies underneath one of the beds. <laughs> it was we, good. It was good. All we do is work. <laughs> we're going to we're gonna have to hire a maid. Let's tell them what we got going on okay. here. So let's see. What do we got here? This is really this what we're is, here for. Right, guys? <laughs> this is interesting. So interesting. interesting. There is. We paid shipping fees the whole bitch to this box, $656, retails $2,878, don't sound too bad. No. Here's the bad part. <laughs> There's a bad part? There's only nine items. What? <laughs> Which is going to come down. Is this for real? <laughs> this is going to come down to... $72.88 a piece. What? <laughs> oh. So we need. Some, I just felt all my hopes and dreams just sink right below me, guys. $73 per item. How just much? $73. <laughs> wow. $73 per item just to break even. What? I do not. I can't remember one item on here. That was it. Let's see what we got here. It doesn't look like 73 bucks. It's nice, but... We got a king bedding set. Oh, great. King size. King size. Things got seashells on it, guys. It, um, it's brand new, Mike. Yeah? That's a good thing. Is it? <clears throat> That's a very good thing, Mike. Next thing I know, you're going to be like, ooh, I want to keep it. Hey, Mike, I want to keep it. <laughs> 73, how many items? King seven piece comforter sets. There it is. All right. Oh. Let's scan it. Okay, let's see what this thing's worth. I hope it's worth 150 because we got to get 73 bucks out of it, guys. I think I need it. <laughs> what is it? Oh, man. Well, it's 150 at Target. So we but saved it's money. <laughs> it's 108 at Bed Bath and Beyond. So it has the one comforter, two shams, a bed skirt, and of course, what Mike just loves is I got to share a story: three decorative pillows. 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 What would anybody need pillows for? Hey, look at this. Yeah, you want to talk? 
What? Go ahead, tell your story. Do you know what it is? I do. She's okay. gonna tell you so, guys a story about one time when she was at work and I decided to have a little yard sale. It wasn't planned. Because we're resellers, right? I saw the neighbors having a yard sale. I walked out in the driveway with my cup of coffee, because that's what I do. And <laughs> I said, oh, this is a money making opportunity. So I started running in the house, grabbing whatever I could get to sell. And what did I sell that day? So he, I call him on my lunch break. I'm like, hey honey, how's it going? He's all good, honey, I'm having a yard sale. I'm like, really? He says, yeah, and I'm all, okay, good. I'm like, what have you been doing? Oh, I've been selling this and this and this. And I got the red toss pillows off our bed. You got the red, oh, you took our pillows off our bed, honey? <laughs> Yeah, I sold them. You sold our pillows? <laughs> I want to tell. I I need to add some details in There's here. There's no details. There are two details that she's missing out, guys. One, detail number one, one of the pillows had a ripped out seam. Well, we didn't know that, though, at the time. Okay. And detail number two, those pillows were not actually on our bed. They were just sitting on the floor in the corner because we never put them back on the bed. But still, if I wanted to make them... <laughs> So I just figured we didn't need them anymore. <laughs> so there you go, guys. Work. There's your we story. Do our, we do make our bed every day. Story of the day. We make our bed, but the pillows never get <laughs> back on there. So what's this? Tommy Hill figure. Oh, Lord help me. It's what is this going to be a long day. Accent chair? It's oh, accent, dining. Accent dining chair. Scan it. Let's scan let's this see. and see what a uh, Tommy Hill figure chair. For a dining room chair. Yeah, I didn't get it. You didn't get it? Why yeah. didn't you get it? I don't know. It only had like five digits on oh, it. Oh, really? I didn't, I didn't see that. I'm kind of thinking see. this might there be an go. eBay item, guys. Um, we'll see what it looks like. But single chairs are so hard to sell. Mm. Maybe somebody on eBay is looking for this because they already have two or three of these. Ooh. Not going to be the easiest one to pull up. So, here's what I'm going to do so you guys can see it better. So here's the chair. So it's like a plastic wicker. And then it has a, a metal base. Okay, interesting. Okay, like that. And is there a cushion? It's so cool. It even comes yeah. with the cushion, you guys. Look at that. Okay. It looked terribly uncomfortable. But it is a cool little chair, and I think it will fill. So what do we got? Tell me, this it, is 150. It is 158. Actually. Is it? Yeah. Oh, so we might be able so to get our 75. We're gonna out get of our point. 75. Okay, so we're at a break-even point. Break even? Yeah. At least we break even. We need, well, so, right. no, you made two dollars. I did? You get to make two dollars, honey. <laughs> I made money on them. So, if we need seventy-three dollars, and we're going to sell that one for seventy-five, okay? All right. Let's see what this is. It's a mystery box. All right, guys. Ta-da! Ta-da! What's this? Glass. Oh, Oh, Fragile. No. Oh man, I think this is a mirror, guys. Fragile. I see the back hanger of it right there. Well, can we open it up? That was laying down flat, guys. That is never yeah. a good situation for a mirror. Oh, here is a. There it is. Never a good is. situation for a mirror, guys. All right. Go ahead and scan it before it yeah. pops it open. Actually, it says cabinet right there. It does. And it, that's, I believe that's what that is. It's an abbreviation cabinet. It's Ooh, really actually... That cute. is it. It's kind this of beat up, though. Wow. Super cute. So it's a farm-style cabinet, guys, with a... Oh. With a sliding door. And a mirror in there. And yes. the mirror's not broken. It is a little, it, it's a little bit beat up, 
but maybe nothing. it's supposed to be that way because look, it's the shabby through here. Maybe oh, this yeah. is supposed to be the shabby. Well, the hardware right here. I'll have to. The handle's bent a little, but this is no. this is very yes, it is right there. It's <laughs> no, vintage. it's farm. It's vintage it's farm. Leave very it alone. Very sellable, guys. That's this what you're gonna label sellable. it as. It's just called vintage. Farm. Very sellable. Vintage farm. Vintage farm. Okay. So are the hanger brackets in there? It looks like it should have some brackets. There is a hardware pack in okay. there. Okay. Alright. So what do we got the on pink, this baby? The pink hardware pack is in there. What do we got on this baby? Box. Are you ready? Yeah. Now, yes, get ready. Oh, am I booming this? You might want to boom it. I would boom it. Hold on, do I got my... Oh, I don't have a boom you shirt You don't have a boom shirt on? No, do you? No. Okay. No. $150. Oh. Wait, I mean it's a boom, boom. It's a boom because you know why? It's only a break even though. But Are we gonna make any money? Hello, we're not going negative right now. We're on a break because when you get to the boom, boom, booms, oh, then we you have, got, you're at least at an even platform so where you're gonna just rock it. Wait, we have boom, boom, boom. I don't know. <laughs> I forgot. I the only one I remembered was the seashell bedding. All right, guys. Of course she remembers the seashell bedding. It's bedding. It's, I'm gonna bet you guys a hundred bucks that she tries to keep that bed. No. Oh, you're not. No, we're not. We're not doing that bed. <laughs> oh. All right. Here's another bedding set. This one. That's just being on This one doesn't look near as expensive, you guys. No. Um, Let me see. Where are you going? Get back on. I'm here. taking a seat. We're not done yet. King five piece comforter set, guys. Ooh. Ah. You're supposed to be scanning. Here, I'll do I got to see what I purchased over I'll do there. It for, okay, I got tiny scanner. You got, I was going to say, you got a tiny scanner on there. You got baby scanner. All right, guys. Here it is. Moment of truth. Uh-oh. 39? What do you got? It, didn't even, it doesn't even like that. That barcode does not exist in the Google Ooh. system. What is it? So, Classic collection? I'm going to guess, just based off of what it feels like mm -hmm. here... I'm gonna say we'll probably sell that for about forty bucks. That's Let's just my see. guess. It doesn't look like the packaging. It just doesn't look like a really expensive one. No, it doesn't. But it, you never know. Any of you guys that haven't been watching us long, you may not know this, but we've been reselling for over twenty years. So there's a lot of things that we have seen, had in our hands over the years. And even if we don't know this exact one, we can usually tell a pretty good idea based off quality of what something ballpark range of what it's worth. If I can at least just get to the brand, uh -huh. it will start to give us an idea at Correct. least. <clears throat> All right, guys, I'm going to dig out another item. It looks like it could be a boom. And I can't even find a, find a brand mm. because you type in classic collection and of course you're going to have everything coming up under the sun. Wow. So it's going to be one that I'm actually going to have to look into more. But I agree with Mike. Um, by the colors, by piece. Just the, the texture of the, of the material. It just doesn't look. It, I think it's new. I just don't think it's expensive. It's going to give me, it's, we're going to give out $35 to $40 mm. in our pocket local sale. And the only reason we're even going to be able to push 40 is because it's gray. Mm. That'd be like trying to sell this on another platform, you know, where you're, you're paying shipping and fees for like $65. So you get our point where that would be a, a hard. Did you sell that little bathrobe the other day? I did. That matches, oh, oh. Very close. And it's one of our members' daughters oh, who bought man. it. Oh, oh I yeah. know who it is. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's right. I saw it. Yes, I, yes, yes. I saw it when she was here to pick it up. Yes. All right, guys. I feel like this is a, this could be a major boom right here. Major award. What is that I got, on the table? I got to give a shout out. Oh. What are you doing with my phone? What are you doing in general? He is out I'm trying control. to show him this, this uh, heater. It's really <laughs> heavy, though. So, I'm going to give a shout out to Stephen Skinner right now. Stephen Skinner! You know who you are. <laughs> he's uh, he's just not a viewer. He is also a reseller. And um, he sent us a funniest picture of something that he so sold today. He thought of us when he was making the packaging with the major award. And it was so funny that his box packaging 
he did just have have us laughing, Stephen. So thank you for sharing that with us. And um, oh, and uh, it it was funny, you guys. It was really funny. He yeah. made the box look just like the wooden crate on a Christmas story. The movie yes and it was hilarious it was funny so this for this heater <clears throat> says it was 206 dollars the re original return reason on here was item is defective but somebody crossed it out and wrote on here changed mine so maybe it's not actually defective guys interesting 206 dollar electric stand-up infrared heater well this is totally stiff look at oh i'm goodness. gonna have to, i'm gonna have to break that seal Darn, break a cardboard seal. Here, here is part of the heater. I don't know if this is the stand or what, but this is 100% factory sealed. Packaging box. I think that's just packaging. Mm -hmm. This, would be this the is one. probably the stand. It's really heavy, and it is factory sealed also. So this is a major win so, right here. There's another part of it down there. This is all sealed. So this is a major win. This is my win. question. Does this run on electric? Electric. Okay. Isn't this so cool? This is awesome. Do they, can they see a picture of it over there? I'm going to put a screenshot in so you guys can actually see what this heater looks like. Like I said, it said on the paper that it was $206. Um, Let me find out. I mean, we'll, if that's still the current price, we're going to probably call this a $100 bill in our pocket. I think if it is a current price, it's very unique. I think you could pull 125 because it is brand new factory sealed. Fifteen hundred. Two hundred and fifty dollars at Target. Oh, there two fifty at Target. Okay. Well, that so, was a Bed Bath and Beyond over there. So there it is. I think it's really neat. I thought we should have kept it, but not at seventy-three dollars per item. <laughs> you choose that. Or the bedding. I'm not keeping any of it. All right. Okay. It's about to get real crazy now. Oh anyway. gosh, I better just keep my phone in my pocket. I feel like stuff this table's so, tipping. This was nine items. We've already done one, two, three, four, five. That means Where's five. There. One, two, three, oh, four, five. five. Up there. There's only four on here left. There's only four items left, guys. These boxes are massive. These might be some of the biggest boxes we have ever gotten. Well, let's, all right, let's get into this. All what right. do we got here? Is, first of all, is there a barcode right up front? Right there. This box is Before in. we end up covering it where I can't scan it. It is factory sealed on this side. What is this? This box is very beat up, though. It says it's an entryway bench. It says it right here. Entryway oh, really? bench with storage. Yeah, you got down my way so I can actually scan it. Four 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 number. Oh, it is a four four four. No wonder I can't. Probably won't work. No, it don't work. Well, you can. Can we even do this? Let's put it that way. Ta-da! Oh, we sold one similar to this. It was a Walker Edison. This is really neat. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna just spin it around. I think you guys are gonna be able to see this. So you can see what it looks like. You can store your shoes there. The cupboard doors slide. It has a cushion bench right there. Two sliding barn doors. B and Willow entryway bench. Let's see what that's worth. I, I'm gonna tell me when you're ready for my help. I'm gonna guess for today's pur guest purposes is 150 in our pocket. If it's not damaged though, this is. This is, um, it's pretty beat up. Oh, it's damaged right there. I is can already see. Just a little bit. So as bad as this packaging is, guys, this is going to have to be inspected very closely. Every corner of this box is, is smashed. Oh, well, hopefully. Here it is. $250. Okay. Ah, don't shut off. I was guessing for $150 in our pocket. Hey, guess That's what awesome. I figured out. I figured out that it's a... No. Boom. What? Look. Yeah, did, now you I did, did it. I did it on the side. Now you did it. No, I didn't. I'm still there. All right, guys. So, 250. That is. That's a That's a boom. We will never be able to pick that box up. We got to buy a forklift. 
<laughs> wow. You guys are not gonna believe the that. Whole palette. <laughs> it's the size of the whole palette. <laughs> All right, Ninja Foodie Tell Pressure about Cooker. That. Let me see where I can find this. This is. Oh my gosh. Man, this almost looks like it could be factory sealed. But the box is in pretty bad shape, you guys. Now, Terry sold a couple of these a week or two ago. What'd you get out of these? What is it? The pressure, booty pressure. 90? 100, 100. Well, you're not going to get 100 out of this one because it is clearly is used, guys. Oh, well, that's a bummer. Yeah. Let's open it up and see. Let's see who returned it. Was it the McNasties? No, no, well, they're pretty clean, uh, but it is used, guys. I'm gonna Holy say. Holy bajolies! I'm gonna. Hey, we're on this item right now. I'm <laughs> gonna say that we'll probably get about sixty bucks out of this one, pre-owned. Oh my gosh! All right, you move your phone. I gotta put this over there. How much for that? Sixty. Okay. All right. Here we go! I know you're all excited about that, but we can't do that one yet. Now this one... Ooh, boy. This could be a big hit, you guys. This is a Stoke brand stroller. Did you scan this, or...? No, I have not. Okay. Uh. Um, these... These are expensive, guys. The real question is, what's the condition? This stro... What the heck? Do it again. It brought up a phone number for... Somebody... In Kansas. In Kansas City, Missouri. Let's call them. Should we? Yeah. Call them. No. Hello? <laughs> yeah, I got your stroller over here. Uh, hey, check okay. it out. Check it out. Um, oh, a little... Dead. Dead ladybug. It's a dead ladybug. Just took a know. ride over here from he Tennessee. Did. He probably froze. froze. <gasps> um, I'm oh. having trouble get. Wait, let's try this. Whoop. I got to get this on here for you guys because you're, you're going to be. That's a model number. It did come up on a random. Let's try this site. I'm not familiar with Bam Bambi Baby. Bambi Baby says this. Wow, I need to find another price somewhere, guys. I don't want to go by this. But okay. they say it's $949. Now, I will tell you that I've sold quite a few Stoke products, and they are expensive. Here it is. Here's the original manufacturer code. It's underneath. Bambi Baby came up. We're going to find yeah. another website. We need to find... We need to find Bed Bath & Beyond. Bambi Baby came up again, and I really got to see it. I told you. Okay. Okay, well, I'm going to screenshot that for a moment here. All right. We will be right back. I need a drink to this. All right, guys, it took a second. We had to dig around a little bit, but we found it on Bed Bath & Beyond, where it originally came from. $999.99. This. There's a screenshot. This. is massive boom guys boom don't but free boom. you know what even used this has still got to have value. Good value it's still got to have value the real question is is this going to even be the right stroller in here oh god why do you say that i was just thinking is it going to be used i didn't think about a bait and switch oh no it, anything's possible at this point you guys oh gosh you scared me now. everybody please cross your fingers with us no 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 over there oh i was doing this one well this is a lifter flap right here a lifter a lifter flap they use Christmas tree shops. That's all. I know. Bed Bath & Beyond has the tape roll that has all their my brands on one My idea, though, roll. was the... Oh, I get it. I was thinking maybe it was just from Christmas time. <gasps> oh, that looks good. That looks good, you guys. Wait, there's a UPC. Scan that. But is this the right one? What in the world we got going on here? Here's the leaf. Oh, no. That's not a good sign. No, it's not. Where, where we got about we got a problem here, Try Houston. That. See what that Houston, Houston. 
stoke seat. Oh, that's just for the seat. So it's got a separate UPC code for the seat. Oh my gosh, seriously? Um, you know what, guys? I think this is the right, the right stroller. Look at this. This even comes with a magazine. Um, I am a little alarmed that this piece is just loose, not in its packaging. I think it's it's right here. It looks like it might have been that used. That was rubbing on it, I think. Oh. The wheels are clean. They, these wheels have never seen the ground. Oh, here's our problem, guys. What happened? Oh, we got a broken wheel. Oh, man. Oh. Probably what I'm going to do, this stroller has enough value. We just talked about this on yesterday's video about buying parts. Mm -hmm. This stroller has enough value. I will buy this wheel. I don't care if I got to spend $50 for one wheel. This stroller has the value, value to make it worth my time and effort to do that. So here's another piece of it right here, guys. So that this was probably damaged in transit when the original person that ordered it got it. They were probably so bummed. But um, I still feel like this is going to be a major win. It's just not going to be today. Wow. I'm still very much impressed. Where, I don't even know where that wheel goes. So here's a wheel. Here's a wheel. Okay, so look like? it's the back wheel on this side. It's this one right down is here it? on the bottom. Yeah. So this is still a major it has win. four wheels. The two bigger ones and the two smaller ones. Oh, one, it's two, that one. three, four. It's okay. Right here. Well, it's see how it's folded in there is why I didn't understand right it. There. Okay. Wow. Well, don't force it. It's all right. Ta-da! Fix it! Still a major win, tire. you guys. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Still, that is insane. Still a major win. I'm still very excited. I'm really curious what this sells for used on eBay. We are going to put a little note in here. Um, wow. Letting you know if we found the wheel, how much it costs. And do you go ahead and check eBay. And... Let's let them know. All right. You're probably going to have to do a manual search. I know. But this is awesome. Brand new. Never been used. Once we get past the damage issue, then um, we'll have a very expensive sellable item that Mike cannot figure out how to put back in here. Not going back the way they had it, guys. Hmm. Well, it's good enough for now because we're going to get the wheel for it anyway. All right. Wow. This is unbelievable. Did you find it? Um, I'm, almost, I'm almost there. Oh, my. We still got one more item. We do. This box is really bad shape. Not heavy, it's just gigantic. Did they change it on, did they change this? Where do you find sold now? Oh, yours is different than mine, but um, should be in here. Oh, maybe should, that one. Thank you. I All saw right. one list. Here it comes, guys, moment of truth. 44 results. I saw one lister for four fifty. So what is? Ooh. Three seventy five. Ouch. What happened here? Oh There's boy, pre-owned forty-eight dollars, hundred and five dollars in shipping. But that's still that's still somebody that's, really got somebody um, got a great deal on that one. They only paid one hundred and fifty bucks for that. Five hundred pre-owned. Oh, yes. Three fifty. Oh, it's man. obviously going to depend on your condition too. Three twelve. There's a wheel. There's a wheel. That's not the same wheel though. No, but that gives you an idea. An Somebody idea. sold a wheel. There's more wheels. Look at those are front wheels. So see you go. There's a back wheel there right, right there. there. Forty-five bucks for the wheel, there guys. There you go. With that free stroller shipping. just became a major boom. That really did. Boom! Yeah! Really did. Oh man! So I feel like in our pocket, all said and done. Oh my goodness! Somebody got. Here it is, brand new. Granted, we won't be able to do this one. 
But they got nine hundred and ninety nine dollars. Wow, full wow. retail price. That's guys. when you want to get that one on your palate. That was right around Christmas time. It More was. than likely, what happened is somebody wanted that. Yep. And the stores were sold, sold out, out, and they couldn't get it, so they turned to eBay, and they were willing to pay the full price for it. Exactly. Okay. So, so how much can you, before we move on? I feel like we could safely say, all said and done, if we sold out on eBay. All, and after we bought a wheel, all said and done, in our pocket. Four hundred. Okay, as I say, three fifty. Three fifty. Because you have to buy minus a wheel. Minus the wheel. Okay, minus the wheel. Three fifty. So, or we could sell it locally, used three fifty. Yeah. Good luck. It's still worth a try. Okay, we can try it. I always try it. All I right. always double. If you're throwing it on eBay, throw it local at the same time. It's Let's worth talk it. about this. <sighs> this big box. Is this new or not? Is this gonna be my question. Completely broken. Oh. Now, with that being said, it it's a piece of furniture, you guys, and I have repaired hundreds of pieces of furniture. I don't like doing it anymore. Part of the reason why we got out of that side of the business. Um, but I will, if the money's there. The money's so, here. Tell them what it is. Is this brand new though? Minus it being broken. I think it's brand new. So what this is... Oh, it's pretty busted up. Six drawer tall dresser. Mm. So you got your five drawers and then two top drawers. It's the one we're doing for you guys. Baby Appleseed Rowan six drawer tall dresser in sand wash. And it retails... Seven hundred and fifty dollars at Bed Bath and Beyond. Oh man! Boom! Oh, broken no. or not, I am booming it. Oh okay. Well, this is what I'm gonna do for you guys. I'm gonna open this up. I will be up to one in the morning, maybe two, once I saw the damage. And I'm gonna to take fix it. I'm gonna take pictures for you. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. <gasps> oh, that's so sad. My night. Oh, here. Well, don't bust it anymore. That can be fixed. That can be reattached. That's our problem right this, there. This whole piece is... This is, this is bad, guys. I'm going to show you. I probably, I probably will not be able to save this. We're gonna try. What? Where's the wee? I got a hamster in my pocket. Yeah. Pretty bad, guys. I'm gonna attempt it. Oh gosh, look at the bottom. This, this, uh. That's just part of the packaging there. Wow. Hopefully that picture worked. That's All right. crazy. Isn't that crazy? At this How point, sad. guys, That's... we're going to consider this zero. That's 750 down yeah. the drain. The good thing about it is it is all real wood. Um, um, which makes it a little easier to repair. But So this is what I'm going to call it, actually, Mike. Mm. It, since it's, it's real wood, and since there was such a high value, and since there are so many people that refurbish furniture... Think. You stop it. I'm going to try it. I would still put it up for $50 and try it. Mm. I'm going to. Okay. I'm counting it as $50. $50, guys. I I don't even know that we would be able to get it loaded in a vehicle without it completely falling apart. Well, that I cannot it's guarantee. It's pretty bad. <laughs> it's very, very disappointing, and it is an unfortunate oh. circumstance. So we'll show you what it looked like. At the store yeah, let's give screenshot, a... and then we'll show you the damn screenshot. Oh thing. man, here it comes, guys. Ugh. All right. Well, where are we at dollar wise? Let's see what we got here. Even with one our, second, our busted up seven hundred dollar dresser. Oh man, I didn't even realize. Oh yeah, it's actually worse than I thought. Oh, I was hoping. Okay, guys, here we go. All right. Even with our busted up dresser. Give it to me. 
We paid six hundred and fifty-six dollars. Okay. All said and done, potential <laughs> projected sales. Projected sales. Gosh, nine hundred and seventy-five dollars. Potential sales. Potential profit. I give up. You were doing so good. Did I use these fancy words? How about I just tell you we paid. <laughs> Six fifty six. We're gonna get back out of it. Nine seventy five. And we're gonna make a potential profit of three hundred and nineteen dollars. You know what? Three hundred bucks. If we can get somebody to take that, we'll wash our hands, walk away from it, and we got this stuff to sell. Yes. That's still not a bad day, guys. It's still not. No. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how we're gonna lift that. Uh, forklift. <laughs> we appreciate you guys tuning in today, watching this. Um, so if you're ever sharing in with our slightly damaged dresser, if you're ever looking at a pallet that has only seven, eight, nine items, it's this is what you really is. get into the high risk category, guys. There it is. <laughs> All right, All right, everybody, appreciate take care you of hanging yourselves. in there with us. No matter what you do today, guys, keep laughing. Bye. Bye.